In this video we will shortly introduce the new major features in Ventus 5.2. First, you can now use real-time shadows that are based on the shadow map technique that can give your scenes even more depth and credibility. The second big feature is the new virtual reality integration. With it you are able to use the HTC Vive and the Oculus Rift to create stunning worlds for your interactive presentations. It is very flexible so that you are not only able to create interactive scenes but also clustered with a video wall or projection or other machines with a head mounted display. Next, you are able to apply the layer effects to just a part of the hierarchy tree by using the newly introduced effect node. This way you can organize your scenes more intuitively again while using the whole image post-processing effect palette of Ventus 5. The video playback was extended by a very interesting video codec for high resolution and multi-video playback. The GPU accelerated hub codecs allow you to playback up to an 8K 60p video or up to 42 HD videos. Also, the in-renderer edit mode was enhanced by adding new camera modes like the free flight camera, walkthrough camera and an orbit camera. With them you can navigate in your 3D world way more intuitively and are able to edit your scene faster and more easily. Next, we now support 10-bit color rendering on NVIDIA and AMD GPUs to enable a more sophisticated look of your scenes. Lastly, we improved the layer workflow a lot. Most importantly, you are now able to optionally use the hierarchy editor to edit your layers. And you can enable an isolate mode on single layers and hierarchy nodes. We hope you like these features and changes and find them as inspiring and useful as we do.